Hello, welcome back to another episode. Watch out, spoilers ahead. Dr. Ben Song has just been taken somewhere that Dr. Sam Beckett could never travel in the 2022 Quantum Leap revival. The cliffhanger ending of Quantum Leap Season 1, Episode 4, A Decent Proposal, sees Ben leap nearly a century before his birth. In the previous episode, Somebody Up There Likes Ben, Ben jumped into the 1970s, which was outside of his own lifespan, which was previously thought to be impossible. Quantum Leap's time travel was initially grounded by the Leaper's lifetime. In Sam Beckett's instance, this meant that he could only jump between 1953 and 1993, with two exclusions due to project problems. A lightning strike swapped Sam's body with his friend Al Kalavici, allowing him to jump to 1945, while a close genetic bond to his great-grandfather allowed Sam to jump back to 1862 in the American Civil War. Ben has no genetic ties to the young boxer whose body he possessed in Episode 3, implying that his Leap in Quantum Leap Episode 5 will be the same. As a result, Quantum Leap has finally violated Sam Beckett's regulations. In Quantum Leap Episode 5, where has Ben jumped to? The fourth episode of Quantum Leap concludes on an intriguing cliffhanger, with Ben going out into an authentic-looking Wild West town. This leap allows the 2022 version to forego the time travel limitations of the original Quantum Leap and take the show in an entirely new direction. The episode 5 summary indicates that Ben has jumped into the year 1898, and there is no mention of any genetic link to Ben's song. Because Ben can now travel further back in time than Sam Beckett, the Quantum Leap reboot can experiment with even more genres than the original. According to the synopsis for Quantum Leap, Season 1, Episode 5, Salvation or Bust, Ben must face a deadly criminal. It's a classic Western movie plot, and it'll be interesting to see if the 2022 Quantum Leap has plans for trips after Ben's lifetime, even though it seems impossible. Ben's ability to think beyond his own lifetime. Ben's ability to see into the future is tied to his mission to save Sam Beckett. Ben disabled the Quantum Leap Project's safety measures while working with Al's daughter Janice, which is why he was able to jump to the 1970s in Episode 3. It's a hazy explanation for how Ben managed to debunk Sam Beckett's string theory, which set the rules of the original program. Beckett saw each individual's life as a piece of string with a beginning and an end, but if the beginning and end were linked together, a person could possibly travel back and forth around the resulting loop. Because Quantum Leap takes place 30 years after the original episode, advancements in in-universe science may allow the equally bright quantum physicist Ben Song to propose a new time travel theory. It has been discovered that Sam and the mysterious Janice Kalavici have been working on their plan for the past year. This timeline shows that Ben's improved leaping abilities aren't only a result of turning off the safeties, but are an important component of their secret strategy to perhaps bring Sam Beckett home. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.